the city when the DSNY shut down the composting program for the city, the larger, you know, we saw a need to kind of compost locally. And so we, uh, we worked to get the, one of these rocket units installed to help us compost here on site um, locally. And um, the rocket works really well for us because it does kind of save labor. Um, and it's kind of a enclosed in vessel cyclical system that cuts down on uh, labor costs as well as um, uh, operation costs. What we do is uh, twice a week we collect, we have a food scrap, we're a food scrap drop off site. And so what we do is we collect um, compost uh, Monday and Thursdays from the general public. And then what we do is we add um, a ratio of one to one. We add one bucket of the food scrap and one bucket of the, of the mulch uh, into the machine, uh, which can hold 500 gallons. And since June 1st, since we started the program, we've diverted almost 20,000 pounds of food scraps from the landfill uh, using uh, this composting machine here. Mainly here, what we're doing, we're processing uh, bread, fruits, vegetables, and coffee grounds primarily. So Domino Park is uh, run by a private developer, uh, Two Trees Management, who is in charge of kind of the larger overall um, waterfront development here. And the company is really dedicated to the community and also to sustainability. And so uh, being able to compost on site was kind of a natural fit to our sustainability uh, goals here in the park. After it runs through the, the composting cycle, we let it cure for another 30 days. And then the finished product, we offer back to the community so they can take it home. Uh, it's very rewarding to drop off your food scraps and immediately pick up a finished compost product that you can then uh, use on your gardens. In addition to that, we use uh, Domino Park compost on all the gardens here, so the gardens are all organic. I think, you know, uh, where we are, I think there's no reason for food scraps to end up in the landfill. You know, a third of all waste, human generated waste, is food scraps. And, you know, we should be composting all of those. Um, and so I think when you have uh, smaller scale kind of systems spread out in individual companies, um, you know, the private sector can really take a lead on pushing that whole sustainability movement forward. Uh, and composting is one of the easiest ways that we can we can help the environment is by um, is by composting our food scraps. So yes, every uh, everybody should be doing it.